What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm gonna teach you guys how to make t-shirts with transfer paper, so stay tuned. Before I do anything, I want to say thank you to everybody that watched my Things to Do in Atlanta video. Take a look if you haven't watched it. It's my first video that broke a thousand, so I'm super grateful. Thank you. Okay, so back to the subject at hand. Um, so the first thing we're going to need is a blank t-shirt. So for me, I found this uh, Gildan t-shirt at this local wholesale store in Atlanta. Um, I'm sure a lot of people know about it, but if you don't, I'll put it in the description below. Um, so yeah, get you a shirt. You can find blank tees at, uh, jiffytees.com. Uh, you can find, you can check your local areas and look for wholesale stores. Um, there's plenty of places where you can get blanks. You can go to Walmart. Um, so you won't have a hard time finding blanks anywhere. So, all right. So the next thing you're going to need is transfer paper. I found this transfer paper on Amazon. Uh, it's called new fun activities uh you can get them by the sheets so you can get five sheets 10 sheets 25 sheets 100 sheets it depends on what you're trying to do and uh how much business you're getting i always use the dark fabric transfer paper because it seems to work perfect on white and dark t-shirts so uh to each his own that's just my personal opinion and um so yeah get you some transfer paper along with your blank t-shirt and let's get started. That's All right, so the next thing you'll need is a printer. The one I chose to use for my transfer paper is the Epson printer, uh, the Epson XP 7100. Um, it costs around 200 bucks, um, but it prints color very well. So if you wanna have great t-shirts, you gotta invest in yourself. So thank me later. Um, you can find this printer at Best Buy, Walmart, uh, pretty much any local store that sells printers. So the last thing you'll need is a heat press. Um, the one I chose to buy is the ePhoto Ink. Um, I paid around like $2.19, I believe. I found it on Amazon. Uh, it didn't take that long to come to me. No longer than like two weeks. Uh, you wanna get a good heat press because you wanna have a heat press that can get temperatures as high as 375, which is the average temperature that you'll need to have a good press. So go ahead, invest in yourself. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna do is cut on my heat press. And we're gonna wait for it to get to 375. All right, y'all, so the next thing you wanna do is find a picture to put on your t-shirt. So in this case, we're gonna go to Google, but I do not advise anybody to keep using Google Photos because you will get sued. Um, the only way you can use Google Photos is if you get a license to use them. So I'm gonna go to Google. All right, so I wanna put Rihanna on my T-shirt. You know what, I want the Rihanna with the mask. this picture so I'm going to save this image and I'm going to put it on my desktop and I'm call it Riri all right next so we're gonna put the transfer paper in the printer and get ready just a little tip when you put the paper in, this type of paper, you wanna make sure that the blue lines are faced up. All right, so now we're gonna print. So let's find the picture. Okay. Here's our picture. Look at that, that came out real good. Y'all, the color is good, the quality is good. Now we just gotta cut around it. All right, so now all we have to do is literally press on our shirt. Make 
accentuate it well. Some people do it upside down. Some people do it this way. I prefer to do mine this way. And I'm going to press it one time just to get it super flat. All right, y'all. So we're ready to finally press. Just got to peel the transfer paper. My rule of thumb is four fingers from the neck. So you literally want to keep doing that until you feel like it's at the right space that you want it at. Um, I feel like I'm happy with where mine is, so. Next, you want to get the Teflon sheet. This normally comes in your transfer paper packet. So we're going to put that on our image. Now we're going to press. So now we have a shirt. Check this out. So you officially made your tea. All right, so that's all I have for you guys. Comment below if this video helped you in any way. Um, also check out my other videos, my other vlogs, my how-to videos, my travel videos, and let me know what you think. Um, share this video. Till next time, I'm out.